Hey everybody, in today's video I'm going to show you how to delete a manually recorded altitude value on your Casio ProTrek PRG270 watch. If you've watched my videos in the past, I've walked you through how you can save a manual recording of your altitude value. In this video, we're going to review those values and then I'm going to show you how you can delete one of them and I'm going to show you how you can delete them all. So the first thing we need to do is from our main timekeeping mode, we're going to press the mode button two times. First time is going to take you to sunrise and sunset information. The second time is going to take you to the recording mode, which basically stores all of your altitude recordings. And there's three different values you've got here. You've got your manual, you've got your automatic values, and then you've got your trek values. The way you can cycle through those is by pressing the barometer button. So you'll notice if I press the barometer button once, it takes me to my auto save values. Press it again, MT is going to be your trek values. I've got a few of those here. What you're looking for is you want to make sure you're on the one that says REC and it will have a number usually. I can use the compass or altimeter button and I can cycle through. There's my second manual recording. There's my third manual recording. Fourth. Fifth. You can store up to 30 manual recordings on this watch. After you get to 30, it will start overriding the earliest one that is on the watch unless you've got it protected. So what I'm going to do is if you want to delete one of these, you're going to want to get use your compass or altimeter button to get on the value you want. So in my case, I've got 13 of them saved. Let's look at number 12, for example. 12 and 13 are basically the exact same thing. 127 was the date, 139 was the time, and my feet was 155. Well, if I go to 12, the only difference is there's a five minute interval, 134 versus 139. Let's say we wanted to delete number 12. While we're on that given value, we are going to press and hold the adjust button. Now you want to be careful here because if you press and hold it, it's going to delete the value that you are on. If you don't let go of it and you continue to press and hold it, it is going to delete every value in your manual recordings. So I'm going to press and hold says clear, I let go of it, and we should have deleted that value. So now if you notice, we've got the um, 139 value, it will move down into the list. So there's no longer 13 of them, now there's only 12. 12 is the 139 value, and the one before it, the 134 value is now gone. Pretty simple stuff. You're going to want to make sure you go to your manual recordings, get to the value you want to, press and hold the adjust button to clear it. If you want to clear them all, you are going to press and hold uh, the adjust button. I'll do a separate video to show you how to do that uh, so you can watch it. As always, I hope the video helps, explains how to do a manual recording. Just FYI, if you wanted to record a trek, I mean delete a trek value, you're going to do the exact same thing. You just want to make sure you're on the treks. So for example, here's my treks. I'm going to just use the barometer button. Instead of the compass and altimeter button, you have to use the barometer button to get to the trek value you want to. And then you would do the same process to delete it. Once you're done, you can press the mode button, get back to your timekeeping mode, and we've successfully deleted our recorded values for our altimeter. I hope the video helps.